Tonight, a Fox 11 investigates follow up into what authorities are still calling the largest heroin investigation ever in Brown County. The court cases involve the distribution of heroin in Brown County. Fox 11 first reported Friday the judge's decision to unseal at least portions of those files. And while those files remain sealed, we are uncovering new information about the cases. For the first time, Brown County District Attorney David Lassay spoke out on the investigation in an interview today with Fox 11's Mark Leland. 29 defendants face charges in connection with distributing heroin in Brown County. The arrest began in July in the midst of an undercover investigation by the Brown County Drug Unit. District Attorney David Lassay kept quiet on the cases until now. The investigation itself has now been completed, uh, largely, that uh, at least the portion of the investigation that had to deal with uh, wire communications has been completed. Those wiretaps used to record secret conversations are the reason the cases have been kept under wraps, sealed by the court until now and only open because Fox 11 went to court in August to get the court records released. On Friday, the judge in the case ruled any information in connection with the wiretaps was to remain sealed, but other information could be made public. Lassay says his office was overly cautious not to jeopardize the cases. It's to protect the innocent third parties that may be calling in. It's also to protect the defendant because even if they are engaged in wrongdoing, we are still accessing their information in a way that is generally protected. So you can't simply disclose the nature of all of those conversations when you are recording them in this top secret way. Fox 11's attorney argued the records should be open to the public. The result is that the public is denied information about legal proceedings that are currently using public resources to pursue alleged criminals and not just any criminals but criminals associated with heroin. The clerk of court's office began the process Monday to unseal portions of the court cases that do not involve the wiretap information. Staffers tell Fox 11 it could take several days to complete, and even then, the information released will still be limited. Lassay says the majority of the defendants charged with distributing heroin are from Brown County. The drug was likely brought in from bigger distributors in Milwaukee and Chicago. I think it's fair to say this is the largest heroin investigation that we've had here in Brown County uh, in terms of the number of the parties involved and the amount of weights that are being transported here. The court records once released will reveal that most of the cases are coming up for hearings in January and February. At that time, trials or sentencing dates will be set. And during those trials, some of the sealed wiretap information will likely be used to make their cases and in turn be made public. For Fox 11 Investigates, I'm Mark Leland.